All right, well, Black Friday is upon us and bargain hunting holiday shoppers out in droves as expected. These are just some of the videos from retailers all across the country. The annual retail mega event began at many of those stores last night and will continue throughout the weekend. And we have had our crews out all morning looking for the biggest lines and the best deals. One of the busiest spots is, of course, the St. John's Town Center. And that is where Channel 4's Ashley Harding talked with several savvy and sleepy shoppers. We've been out here at the St. John's Town Center all morning. This is the busiest we've seen it. Not only have I personally been able to shop for myself, but also for my little boy. So many great deals that people are taking advantage of. Doorbusters, you name it, deals and steals. Look how many people have been out here. It was a little bit of a slow start this morning, but it didn't matter. As the hours went on, more and more people arrived. One thing you do want to take advantage of while this St. John's Town Center is open all day, go online to their website and you will find a list of every kind of deal and steal for all the stores. It's about seven pages worth. They are updating throughout the day as well. But we've been talking to a lot of shoppers. Some, it's kind of a religion. It's something they do every year. Others are first timers, but for the most part, everyone's really been enjoying it. It's been running very smoothly. This is what some people told us. Yeah, we waited in line at Sephora and we got some perfume and some makeup. Awesome. My uh, the college I go to is business casual, so I need lots of business casual. <laughs> so like dress pants, casual. like button down shirts. You should also expect to see lots of traffic out here. People looking for parking. It can get a little crazy. One thing you can do to avoid that. They now have the complimentary shuttle service. Just call those numbers. You will get picked up by that shuttle. They will take you to what store you need to go to. For instance, if you park over by Nordstrom, but you need to get to Target, you can do that. They will take you. Again, look at those numbers right here. Also, later on tonight, we'll take a look at overall safety while Black Friday shopping. Reporting from the St. John's Town Center, Ashley Harding, Channel 4, the local station. All right, Ashley, thank you. Ashley clearly making the most out of her assignment this morning. A local gun store certainly feeling the Black Friday frenzy as well. We have a photo taken outside of Shooters in Jacksonville. This is in Inglewood, and you can see that line is wrapped all around the building. Some of the Black Friday deals include a Rough Rider revolver for $140 and a Micro Bel Air pistol going for $640. Shooters is also offering deals on their ammo, cases, and earmuffs. A consumer alert on Black Friday, the FBI wants you to know that it is also the season for holiday scams. One of the most common online shopping scams. If the deal looks to be too good to be true, it certainly likely is. The best advice, avoid unfamiliar sites offering unrealistic discounts on brand name merchandise or gift cards. Also, be wary of social media scams. Avoid social media postings that appear to have a holiday promotion but ask you to participate in in an online survey. That needs to be your red flag because it really could just be trying to steal your personal information. Plus, smartphone app scams. Be careful what you download. Some apps could be designed to steal personal information right off your device. Before downloading the app, look for third-party reviews. Those are really going to help you. And also, we posted additional steps to avoid becoming a victim of fraud on news4jacks.com. There you can also find a list of store hours for local malls and an interactive map. We're going to show you how congested the roads are before you head out to your favorite shopping spot.